have you. Just be sure there's enough champagne. But all the fourth one is your okay, Miss Ellen. Uh, hello. hello. Is Miss Kingship at home? Yes, she is. Good. Oh, first hello, Ellen. Hello. How are you? Everybody's going to be coming along. You think you have troubles. Where are those parking boys I ordered? <laughs> well, I certainly picked a swell time to call, didn't I? A hectic last minute, Gordon. But the perfect day. So to show off this. Gee. That's a pretty ring. Congratulations. Well, I, now I know I picked the wrong time. Look, uh, suppose I give you a call sometime tomorrow, the next day, huh? Don't you dare go. No, honestly, I think my business is just a little out of tune with your festivities here. It can wait. If you think after that I'm going to spend the afternoon wondering, that's all I need. Well, can you spare a minute? Sure, come in. If I can spare a minute, so can you. Well, it concerns your sister's friend, you know, the late disc jockey Dwight Powell. Seems that... Uh, he was quite a tennis player, too. You know, I helped my uncle wrap up that case. I all well, made the usual inquiries to fill out the record, and, well, there's one interesting fact that just came straggling in. It seems that on the day your sister died, Dwight Powell was playing tennis in a tournament in Mexico City. He'd been there almost a week. I don't believe it. Well, you'll have to. His teammates dug up a news picture. There he was. And that was the date. He wasn't in Lupton. He couldn't have killed her. He didn't kill her. Why kill himself? That's it. So instead of murder and a suicide, we have something else. Two murders. Do you want to go a step further? The man who killed Dorothy is still free. That's right. Well, I guess the next time I say I'd better go, you'd better let me. Uh, actually, I gambled. I, I thought I saw enough happiness there to override most anything. Anyway, as far as I'm concerned, the case is just starting. I'll keep you posted. Gordon, you're not leaving. I have to. I think my minute's just about up. Oh, Ellen. 